This is Dynamic Polygon, and I'm going to be showing you how to use Android applications on your Windows laptop, tablet, or desktop. So what you first want to do is install this free application called BlueStacks. So you can just Google it to find it. So I'm going to double click on it, load it up. Now the application has low resolution. But that's doesn't that's not a problem when you actually use the apps. So if I use the eBay app, the eBay app mobile app is gonna have low resolution. But if I use the Angry Birds app, it's gonna work fine. So you have access to the Amazon store, the Google Play store, and one other third party store that I haven't really heard of before. And I think that one is its symbol, but I'm not exactly sure. Or logo. So um, yeah, you can go up here, search for an app, just find out whatever you want to install. If it's on the Google um, App Store, you can download it. So I downloaded Angry Birds, so I'll load Angry Birds. And the resolution on Angry Birds looks really good on this. Compared to the interface of BlueStacks, one's fine too. Let's go ahead and load the uh, game up. Run smooth. And this is running basically, yeah, Android on Windows. So it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, now to exit it, you can just press the home button or the flag button if you have one. Go back to your desktop, and you'll have the menu here, and you can just press the exit button, and you are now back to your Windows desktop. So I've heard some people say you can't have access to Android apps on a Windows tablet, and Windows doesn't have many applications on their store, so Windows tablets aren't good at all. Uh, you actually can have access to Android applications on Windows tablets. What you want to make sure you have, though, is full Windows operating system and not the ARM version, otherwise you will just have access to the Windows applications. So that's it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll try to respond.